This is Eurovision 2014, or as I call it, YOLO vision. You only live once vision. I came to explore. Hashtag join us is the biggest hashtag in Eurovision history. So expensive, the best minds came up with it somehow. Would you mind having like a, a gay president, like a gay leader in your country? Actually, it doesn't matter. Because Putin is so gay and doesn't admit it, he keeps walking shirtless all over the place and like shooting. You're talking about it with me. Let's talk about something. Okay, good idea, kish, I know. Kish, kish. Let me kish. I know. Oh, I fly Ukrainian airlines all the time because nobody yeah. else flies them. It's so cheap now. <laughs> yeah, it's empty. Really? But how can I not vote for Ukraine after all the things that happened? Like, how can I vote for you and not for Ukraine? You know what? Yeah. Because we are very colorful. Yeah. We are very cute. Yeah. <laughs> Eurovision is the last line of defense against anti-gay Russian propaganda. Light it up. So yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Is this also about Putin or the Ukraine or anything? Or nothing to do with so, that? Yeah. Yes. This is San Marino, mm -hmm. Valentina Moneta. Yes. I know. Maybe. Yeah. But I love Absolutely. the Absolutely. I have the this P is real. Putin uh, butt plug. Yeah. Uh, if right. all the people in the world mm -hmm. want yeah. love in the world, you can change the world. Yeah. Okay. okay, brilliant. Thank you. Good luck. Thank okay, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank I tried to set up the couches like in between two ferns, the Zach Galifaniakis show on Funny or Die. <laughs> you have to move yeah. your hips like. La, I need to like. Yes, beautiful. <laughs> um, do you want to get like a UK passport? UK passport. Citizenship if you win. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This not? is the solution to immigration. People say the true winner of the Eurovision is Yuki, really. <laughs> yeah. So do you have to be like a liberal democrat if you love the Eurovision because they love Europe? I think it might help, although I'm sure certain Tories will find themselves loosening their ties and getting down when they hear this music. It's amazing. Yeah. Down and coming. I'm sorry, coming what? And you said Israel was ousted for like anti-Semitic reasons? Now she doesn't make the final. I'm, yeah. con I'm convinced it's anti-Semitism. And what about the issue with Crimea? They still have the Ukraine phone system, so they can vote for Russia. It's funny, no one actually knows what's going on. The EBU mm. is trying to figure this out with the mobile phone operators right now. But basically, if you're in Crimea, um, your vote may count as Ukraine or it may count as coming from Russia. No really? one knows. You're the only one singing not in English. No, we sing in French because yeah, French is so sexy. Mon téléphone, c'est ma vie. Relié à mes amis. En mode illimité, connecté jour et nuit. And it's a song about World War One, right? Yeah, yeah. It's a song about the trenches. Okay. Any places in Kiev that are like cool, like East London? Yeah, there are some. Yeah. Yeah. Kiev vicious. Like, yeah. Yeah, the center of Kiev. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kiev. I want to open a Primark shop in Kiev to bring Primark, the cheap clothing, to Kiev. <laughs> I'm like a flaccid, like low sexual vibe. Yeah, low, low very low. low. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm emotionally available, basically, like, I am physically unavailable, but emotionally I'm available and, and I never had a Ukraine girlfriend and I, I, I'm not going to date any other Russian girls, like, until... What are you talking about? 